Hello, this is Zachary, and I'm going to show you how to take apart an old ball mouse, like uh, the old kind. So, uh, first, you can, the only thing you're going to need besides the mouse is uh, a um, precision screwdriver set. Uh, you're going to want to open it up and take out um, the uh, Phillips head, with this, uh, this kind. Plus, and the um, flat head, like this. Okay. Um, you're gonna wanna get your, this is an old compact one. Um, most, uh, mo I think they have, most, most compacts have the same design. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your um, Phillips head, your, there should be a hole on the bottom. Don't worry, it's the only hole you have to take apart. Um, then you just put it in and turn it backwards. And when it gets super easy, you can probably just dump the screw out. The screw should look something like this. Okay, then uh, you can just, most have like this on the bottom, I can just screw that, take it out, and like that. Um, you put that there, the bottom should look something like that. Then you're going to want to pull and pull. Even if it cracks, it's, don't worry, it's not broken. Um, it just means that this thing here um, came out of this thing here very fast. So, uh, this thing isn't very important. You don't really, it's kind of boring. All it is is just such a little turny thing. You just put that aside for now. Then you go into the inside and you have these buttons here. Uh, here. Uh, those are the mouse buttons. The, these two here, the mouse buttons, this one, this one. Um, and the one that's under this um, is for the, the ball, not the ball, the uh, spinny track thingy. Um, to hit and uh, like do what it does. Okay. Um, inside you'll see stuff like an IC or I mean IC whatever it's called. Um, and you can solder it out and do whatever you want with it with all the stuff. And what it's what this thing does is these little things inside it. There's one here and one here. One here, one here. Um, the ball sits inside those, and when the ball turns, it pushes. I mean, it turns all those little servos they're called around, um, and it sends a signal to these cables here. It's hard to think only five of them could uh, do it, what it does. Um, it sends a signal to the cable, and then sends the signal to the computer and moves your mouse on the screen. So yeah, and uh, don't worry, you can put it back together like this. You can just uh, get the this thing, put it into the bottom, then drop the mouse ball on top of it, then uh, put this like that. Should be easy. Uh, technical difficulties. Like last time. Hmm. Well, last time I tried it, it worked. So we're going to want to. Uh, well, if it gets in properly, uh, you just screw in that screw, and then. And through and that through there, and pretty much it'll, it'll probably work if you plug it in properly. And uh, yeah, okay. And thanks for watching. And uh, I hope you thought it was a good help. Of this, I thought this video was a good help. Thanks. Bye.